Hello everyone. Today I'm going to show you how to use Audacity to remove a vocal from an MP3 or a web file. Uh, if you're lucky, you'll get a perfect instrumental. If you're not, it might come as um, a very low sound. So let's see what I can do with uh, this song. This this is my own composed song, so I'll use it in this video anyway. I can find a way. That's me singing. Very terrible. Light is the way of it. Actually, it should be lightened, but I say light this. Okay, anyway, let's use it. Uh, here is my audacity. Ah yeah, great. This is a new version of Audacity. This they have just launched it about maybe one or uh, two months. So let's see what I can do. Hmm. What is it? Oh, here it is. So loading, 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 loading. Okay. This is a stereo MP3. It is in MP3 format. So make sure you choose a stereo mp3 or a stereo wave file so a lot of people has been asking in my previous video where is the mono where is the mono where is the mono that's a, a mono option in this drop down does not present in a new version of audacity so there's only one option that's called split stereo to mono so if you follow with me <coughs> sorry i got a sore through uh, if you follow with me right now so click on split stereo to mono let's try it see now split okay let me undo that so let me play first here so that you can hear it that it is a stereo see i hope you have a better headphone so that you can hear left right see? find a way now you can hear me singing so let's play it to stereo to mono now split stereo to mono so at you as you can see that uh, there's a line divided between these two channel so now both the channel has been mixed together in one channel so let's see how it sound can you hear the difference so that's very nice. That is a very nice different. Sweet little light, where will you take me? Now you can hear a very, very, very loud voice of mine. So let's try to remove that. First, click on this bottom of this channel so you you can see that uh, this uh, little, little gray blue thing turn into a very light green things until you see this color it mean that this part is selected so go to effect you'll see written here equalization oops it's already there so first you will see an equalization with straight line something like this so mine i think i'll drop to 100 100 yes i'll drop to 100 on that's depend on your requirement if you feel that this 100 hertz 100 hertz is not enough so you can increase to 140 or maybe 200 straight with that 0 db okay let's try with 100 Oops, it's not yet 100 okay 100 hmm now you see some changing in the track now i play now i play only one channel let's see how it uh, change the sound you can hear all the loud noise has been removed so let's try to play this one. In darkness, 
now this one is a little louder than this one okay so now we have done that let's go for the second track so click here go to effect and you can see an option called effect called invert so if you click this invert it will invert the audio it will invert i i hope you know what is invert which means pan all this uh, middle one into a into a center so which means all the center of the track is being removed so i don't know what kind of function it is how it works so it just works like that it's just invert the channel that's all so let's test it how it sound let's start it. okay let's hear here You can hear a little bit of my sound but with the bass thing so that's why i use equalization so that you will not hear something called like na 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 you will don't want to hear that sound so that's why i use equalization to make it a little bit uh, to have a bass or something like that. now you can hear the drum the, the snare of the drum so if i don't apply equalization you will not hear that so i will show you how and what's the difference between equalization and without equalization see that's uh, not a perfect i say but it is better than it's better than I don't know how to say okay let's let me show you without equalization to split to mono uh, let's apply invert here so go to effect Ec invert so without equalization like I tell you from the beginning it all depends on what track you use if you use a very high quality track you don't need to apply any equalization so um, I show you we apply an, an equalization if you use uh, some maybe 128 uh, 128 quality of an p3 so if I use trade if you use 300 above you can do this without any equalization so now you can hear very nice instrumental without any voice now even in this part there is no more voice so you can hear now in this part you can hear some voice very bass voice I hope you use a headphone so that you can hear the difference so I will let you decide which one which one is better a track with equalization or a track without equalization that's your choice but the step and process is same thing only so Let's try to save this one. If you want to export this, you have to uh, go to file, export. I don't think we can export MP3. Or oh, maybe we can. So I think we'll choose. I'll choose in sync. Let's try what it is. Variable for standard. Okay, let's go. Then light instru instrumental. Sorry, I talk too much. Uh, no, 
we cannot export mp3 because I don't have the li LAM library or I don't know what it is so let's put it to wave okay whatever then now artist name is uh, mr. David L U C K Y. Chuck title let's say L I J H T. Album let's say YouTube YouTube. Nops. How to remove wo vocal from MP3 slash blue AV. Yeah, 28 what do you want me to call it I don't know what kind of music is that so I just leave it blank comment thank you as you be s s c l i subscribe share light and check the bell Check the bell of notification so that you can you will so you will stay up to date for my next video on uh, all the video. Okay, let me click. Okay. Da 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 okay now here we go. Minimize minimize refresh that let's say this is yes mp3. Let's play it. I will find a way to reach where you are Yay! We did it! Now, you can do almost in every song But uh, One thing you should know that uh, It depends on what kind of song you use The high quality, the better The more quality, the better so I hope you enjoyed the video. So see you on the next one. I mean see you on Friday. Thank you. Share, subscribe, and like, and put a comment below. Comment any doubt you want so that I can get in touch with you. Okay. Thank you. Bye. David out.